Hello Dagger community, I'm glad that you're watching our YouTube channel. If you're not subscribed, please subscribe. And before I will go to the topic of our video, what's the difference between uh, Parrot 2.0, Parrot 3.0 and Nestor? Let's quickly check what we got on the pocket. Today I carry Urban 2. This is our Discover Line model. Uh, which costs only $30 and I really enjoy, really like this knife, really handy and not really um, heavy, yes. And please type in the comments below what you are carrying because I'm really curious to know it. So now let's dip into this uh, topic and let's have a closer look on the Parrot knives. Okay, so let's have a closer look on the Parrot 2.0, Parrot 3.0 and Nestor. And I will try to describe actually what are the differences because we are receiving a lot of questions. What's the difference between Parrot 2.0 and 3.0? So initially, if you're following our brand, initially we have presented on the market Parrot 1.0. Here will be a picture. So later on, since the knife is actually pretty tactical, it has a very thick blade, very thick blade, four millimeters, and it's really big and really handy. We've decided, and after receiving some feedback from our clients, the users of the knife, we've decided that we need to make this knife with such a feature that you can easily turn this knife into the uh, fixed blade. Of course, it's not a real fixed blade, right? But it has this possibility. So what we did in the Parrot 2.0, we've added jimping. So on Parrot 1.0, there was no jimping here on the spine. Yeah, now it's more handy. And also we have added possibility to unscrew. So take out the screw from here and put it here. We will show here the video, so how it works. Now, later on, uh, we have received another feedback selling uh, uh, Parrot 2.0 that uh, you want the possibility to unscrew this uh, uh, pin without a screwdriver. So what we did, we did Parrot 3.0. So we made a pin with the ring so that you can easily actually take it out yes by rotating so like i am doing now so you can easily take this pin out and put this pin into this place so making this knife a fixed blade okay so now if i will push the button you see, it doesn't lock. So that's a 3.0. But also, what's the difference between para 2.0 and 3.0 is the thickness of the liners. On para 2.0, we are using 1.5 millimeter liners. And here on para 3.0, we are using 2 millimeter liners. So now in the new batch of the parrots, basically, they will be in a box. You are going to receive both types of the pins and finally what is a nester because if you look this knife looks similar to this one or similar to the this one but this knife is called nester why it's called nester because of the grind you see here we have a dagger grind spear point blade and we call it nester why because the nester is actually a parrot which is a very aggressive and it's actually a predator parrot so since this blade it's more combat type of the blade we've decided to call this knife nester so that's actually the whole story about these knives and what's the difference between parrot 2.0 and parrot 3.0 so i hope you uh, have now the full information about these knives. If you still have some questions, please type in the comments below and of course we will answer them. Thank you for watching and have a great day.